Great, very distinguished pose there, Banjo. <laughs> hey there, everyone, this is Aokao playing Banjo Kazooie. And uh, yeah, this is World 5, we're going right on it. We're wasting no time. We're on a hunt for moon in this place, the spooky red cave, Pterodactyl Land. Uh, a wonderful place, and guess what? Yeah, we already got one move out of three. That's right. So that place with the caveman in World 1. Already, that's just a little place where indeed you start and you visit another world. You do so very early in the game. I think that's so ra- Oh wow, you take like two- No, you take just one, you then just fade. Look like a button or something on top here? Yeah, can I hit that? Uh, uh, I'm just gonna switch like this, maybe? No? Uh, what if we blow it up? Blow up a button! Alright, we did it! That guy is free now! A little blue guy. Alright, so welcome to where it's brown and rocky. We're gonna find our way, hopefully. There's a ram that lets you go to this tiny cave. I don't... I, I honestly, genuinely feel like I do not remember anything about how this place is constructed, like, at all. So... I'm, I'm sure things are gonna come back over time. But, uh, yeah, no, we're just, we're just going in and hoping for the best. Okay, so that leads us to here, where this guy is in the way. What if I blow him up, huh? Hey, get exploded, idiot. You never get jiggy from Rock Nut Tribe. Hmm, yeah, you're bumping yourself on the head, too. Fee smart. Alright, let's get some notes. If we want moves, we need notes, so... I'm gonna get some of these. Uh, I think that's, yeah, that is literally right beside where I was at the start. Did not do a whole lot. Mambo's house is there. It's pretty good. There's an exagon. Oh, hey, there's an egg. Hey, stop it. So, if we want to split real soon, maybe we can hatch it or something. Oh, no. Right, there's a Kazooie branded button or door. And there's a thing. Like, there's like a ton of things happening. I just kind of have to take a path and like take it. Because otherwise, you know, we'll be just lost forever. I uh, will come be coming back down here eventually. I am just taking paths. I saw a waterfall. There's a vine behind a waterfall. It's pretty good. Welcome to River Passage, idiot. Why why did I why did I get so insulting? I don't know. Felt like the right thing to, well there's a hexagon. Can I get there? Hopefully. Eh. Yeah, don't slip, don't slip, don't slip. Hey, free hexagon for you and me. I mean, it's free as, as you know, I thought about turning the camera around. That is my reward. Oh, the frame rate sorta exists here. It's pretty good. It is called a river passage. This is a passage around a river. Oof. Uh, uh. Anything here? Well, there's a bit more frame rate. <laughs> Change it to first person view. I don't know why. Okay, so there's stuff underwater. At least some notes. And here's a move here, but it's too high up. Okay. So if we want to move, we need to find a way to like get there. All right. Well, there's a bunch of notes. I gotta get that. I have air again that I need to manage. And a little bit of air here. That's not air. That's a note. Those are different things. You do not sing air, typically. Nothing's stopping you, but I don't know what the result would be. I'm going to be real. Okay, so yeah, I can hear the electric eels. A beautiful dance of electrical discharge. Hey, bye. Hey there. Okay, so... There's a pistachio, brother. Oh, can I just climb her onto here and that's how we get to the good stuff? Because that's here. Can you turn the camera? No, this is a different place. Okay, and there's like gold nuggets everywhere. And here's a split. Alright. It's exciting in the Oogle and Unga cave. Okay. 
So there's a place called Oogle and Unga Cave, and there's where you use an egg of some kind, I guess that's what you're saying. So where's that place where there's a move? I should be able to get... Like, I feel like I lost track. When I went to, like... Uh-oh. Uh... To get those notes. Yeah, because this is an exit. Okay. So the move is on uh, the other direction. Okay, so in that case... Yeah, in here the ledge does go there, so I'm gonna assume if there is indeed... Oh, is there like a fork in the river? If there's a split path, I'm gonna guess that you want me to switch to Banjo, and Banjo's gonna get a move over there. Like, that seems like the logical progress of things here. Just using my ability to notice things. Yeah, because otherwise, why would there be a split path? I mean, maybe there is no reason, and I'm just falling for it. It's possible. All right, buddy. Yeah. Yeah. You still have, like, a high jump. Like, if you, like, hold Z. All right, so you can do this. You're like, yeah. Then maybe I'm going to go to it. Then it's going to go back. No. I don't know, because, like, there's, uh, feathers here. All right, let's just double-check with them. <laughs> no way, son. I'll only teach you this once you've got... Yeah, 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 yeah. Wow, just being very, very insulting. But you see, yeah, like, they're already respawning. There is no way. Really? You won't continue past here? Yeah, you can't, like, jump. You cannot attack at all. Okay, it's just the timing is very stricter than I give it credit for. That's all there is to it. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, like, as soon as he's done biting, you have to go. Okay, alright, hey. Hey, sup. <laughs> what do we get? Taxi pack! No, Kazooie means space in your pack. A way to fill it is what you lack. Pick large things up off the ground. In they go and carry them around. You're not telling me how to do it. You did not... Do I just do it? Do I just approach a thing and I pick it up? You're not saying how I need to hold this button while crouching to go into pickup mode, uh, you know? Kind of very important instructions. <laughs> because that's just not important enough. I didn't realize that we go, like, across a thing when we go there. Yeah, this is like on the other side. Okay, no wonder I felt getting displaced. Uh, huh. Alright, well, that's done. So, I don't know where we're going now. Well, the other side of this cave. Is this the right direction? I am honestly unsure. Uh, well, we'll see if it's different than... Yeah, this is where I came from. So we're going the other way around. Uh, wow, that took some effort. Yeah, it's, it's working out timing. That's not necessarily obvious. Yeah, I don't know. This I want maybe there's a third fork that I'm just being blind to. It's possible. I hope not. Well, if I ever get lost, this is a place that I'll surely forget exists. Looking forward to it. <laughs> like just being real here. Big old mossy green zone. But hey, look at this sweet opening here. Out into the light! Uh, where are we going? That leads us to a cave. Yeah, Therac Therdaclion. Okay, I don't know if- we're Oh, okay, I think the person that's played this game before, that is me, remembers this place. It's like a lake on top of the mountain. Yeah, we did go up a vine to get up here. And here you, you tease me with an egg. Um, 
this very specific, like, column. Why would you do that, my friend? Is that because we need to get something in there? In that cave? I mean, he's there. I don't see what we could do. Like, if you throw a clockwork, does it go in the thing or does it hit the wall? Yeah, I see it hitting the wall. I don't think there's a way it can go in it, right? Or is there? I can't really see. Like, there's that guy, sure. Yeah, I don't really see it here. Let's get a little closer, huh? Like, that kind of looks like it wants to be an opening, but it's just... Oh! But this here is an opening. Check it out, it's me! It's Tiny Me! I am... Whoa, okay, there's a little cave, a little tiny cave for a little tiny thing that we can just shove right in. Alright, 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 okay. Oh, I see. Here's his butt! Blow up a man's butt! And the man is dead. <laughs> Why did I do that? Oh, so we're supposed to mess up a number of them. I didn't realize that. Oh, so the other guy that you encounter at the very start of the level, you can probably blow him at the same way too then. Okay, all right. Well, here we are. I don't know what I'm doing at all. This is kind of the scary place. It really is. Uh, okay, well, there's a portal there. I don't know. I'm doing things. There's also a mumbo zone right in front of the wigwam. That's pretty teepee. Sorry. Wigwam's around, I was told. I have no reasons to doubt you. Okay, uh, there's a little door here. It's adorable. Let's blow it up. Sounds like, you know, how we solve most of our problems. Ain't gonna work, son. Alright, there's a spring boots. And here's an opening right up here. It's nice and warm and cozy. Also, a bear can't do the climbing. And we're just kind of used to that kind of thing. Oh, well, local global in the area right here. Hey, buddy. All right, well, let's continue to explore. Check it out. And that leads us back here, where we were just were. If you don't take the path that looks like you're going underwater. <laughs> Saying it just like in the worst, most awkward way. There's a big opening here, but there's like notes here. And, uh, you know when I think about notes, I think they're a good key to getting moves. I've said that very often. Path to nest! Okay. Sounds great! I don't know where I am or what I'm doing. All I know is I'm doing it. Okay, well this looks... Oh, past the nest. Alright, here's a sign. What do you got to say, sign? Only one secret code of the dinosaurs! Uh, well then. We need to learn the secret code of the dinosaurs, clearly. Yeah, once more, I go on the path with the notes more. With more notes. That is a path I am interested in. Okay, there you go. Now I can make a turn. Doing some light platforming in this game, it can happen. Sometimes when you're not looking, it'll sneak up on you. It's pretty great. Have I been into this cave before? I don't know. It's red. And brown. Mostly red. Hey, remember this place? There you go! Want to learn how to sit down, Kazooie? Or want to have quick access to World 1, one or the other? There's where it happens. Oh my gosh, we stepped into Pterodactyl Land all this time ago! Alright, it's pretty great. Uh, so I've done that. I kind of went on a big loop here. Let's get closer to Mumbo's, maybe? As I'm just kind of... Trying to not commit to anything? There could be a thing inside a TP. So maybe... You know what? I'll just go ahead and give her a Globo. So I don't have to think about it. Alright, doesn't look like it's in here. I do! Sure. Here you go. Sure. There you go. Hop right in. 
I'll do that later. I'm not ready for that right now. Because I feel like whenever you transform, then you're on a path of solving things. There's a button over there. Those are always exciting. Uh, there's a cave here, too. Okay, there's things making sounds. Always a treasure. That also looks like a button over here. We're gonna press a button. Oh, it's train button! Train button! I found you! You're like in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> this is train button. Like, where even is this? I don't know, it's somewhere in the level, don't worry about it. We gotta wait for now to load. Okay, they're not loading in the... where the train is at to make a move over. That's cool. But in here, it's pretty big. I can't activate it. That makes me sad. I'm gonna throw a grenade at it. Oh, somehow I changed my thing. Good job! Ah, okay. Not responding. That guy's sad. He's like, wee wee. I know, right? Eh, sorry, but I can't get to you. I'm not. I can't press the button. The button will not be pressed today. It's not that kind of thing. Okay, I, saw, I thought I saw something. I did. Then the rock appeared over it, but a rock is not an obstacle. I have had the ability to deal with large rocks for like a few days now. Check this out. Uh, drill mode! I barely touched it, but it counted. I'm happy for that. Welcome to the Swamp Zone. Whoa, check it out. Dinosaurs and stuff in the Swamp Zone. So we've been on the other side of that. Wow, I fell in the swamp and barely felt that. Another dinosaur -y face. And a guy is running at me. Whoa, actual wadding boots. <laughs> so I'm gonna assume that you want me to hatch that massive egg there. I just don't know yet how I would do that, because first I need to split. You can't hatch if you're a banjo, you know? That's just common sense. Well, okay, so, no, okay, yeah, that just happened. Um, well, there's wanding boots. Do I do not have, uh, like, I saw the grip, grippy wall. Uh, did I? It's like over there, okay. Well, we got wadding boots, we're gonna actually wear boots! Unbelievable! Can you believe that? Doing a thing from the first game! Oh man, oh man. We did it. We crossed over and one day, a certain magical man is gonna do something right here. And there's an easy access portal right here. Really good. I'm hearing giggling! I got the globe. Oh, so what's up here? I don't know, man. Let's find out and go over a thing. Me, me, crawling on these rock sides. Hey, pistachio brother, where you at? You're gonna get poked. You lost your head! And yet your body reflexively just goes right back in. Is nature not beautiful? If you don't have the drill move somehow, do bad! I missed entirely. <laughs> I did it! Get destroyed. Oh, page. Okay. Yeah, those exist. Still. There's still a, a thing I want to get. Oh, look at that! He respawned just in time to have his head exploded again. <laughs> his world is sadness. So we saw two mumbo pad. I am going to be triggering one. The other one near the wigwam, I'm going to abuse the fact that I already know some things about this game to not interact with that yet. Because I don't feel ready for that yet. I just, like, there's a lot of things that are just kind of a thing, I feel like. Alright, where's your... there, here's close enough. Welcome again! Yeah, got a globo. You're gonna get the globo. Everyone gets a globo. Everyone globos here. We need all the help we can get. Throw it in the bag. Dad gets him off his butt and walking around and fishes one out of his diapers. Alright, so, um, yeah, so there's a thing like right in front of this place. And we're just gonna go ahead and do that real quick, just so it's done. 
It's an important little thing. Well, it's not important at all, but I feel- I, I remember it helping navigation. Let's see, ah, it's over here. Never mind the shape that things have, it, it doesn't matter. Alright. Here we go! Hope this works! Do a little dance! Enlarge! The stepping stones! Yeah, this probably has nothing to do with, uh... Again, don't look at shapes. Uh, this probably has nothing to do with the fact that this is in front of, uh, the teepee. Nothing at all. Totally cannot intuit what might be happening there. Alright, I'm getting close to session end. Is there anything I want to get involved with while I'm here? There was a Kazooie branded gate of some kind, like in the water there. I, th I think, I guess I can check out what's with that. And, oh, look at that, you let me go forward after doing that, that's pretty nice. Yeah, uh, like, yeah, in the water here, like, again, like, there's a bunch of stuff I can't really interact with, but is there anything within the water itself, which has a nice little access ramp? I mean, unless I can jump to that hexagon, like, I can get it here, no problem. But again, like, we need to be split up, I can't just say to Kazooie, hey, Kazooie, you feel like getting up? Oh, I can totally do this easily. What? Also, wait a second. How can you not climber onto that, Banjo? Uh, I guess we'll wait for whatever solution they actually want. Okay, there's the Kazooie branded hole. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do that. Yeah! Then I'm going to... Oh, you can do like a jump. It's pretty exciting. It's like a button more than anything. Oh, that counted. Wow, so that's pretty involved, like one guy, but okay. Sure. Uh, where is that? There he is, right here. He's brown? Ginjo. Ginjo. Yeah, I guess so. There's a brown Ninjo. I wonder, because like I did do like a pretty sweet little jump there with uh, Kazooie. Can I do that here? I love how your air disappears. Yeah, like, can you get beached? <laughs> okay, I don't think that's gonna work. But you know what is gonna work? Like, around up here, maybe? <laughs> no? Really? So, if you use a clockwork egg, you don't get the clockwork if you're underwater? I guess I can kind of see it. Yay, I did it! And there you go, see? You can just then go ahead and get it. That's probably cheese, but like, otherwise it's, I don't know, man, get here with like, running shoes? Then run on it, like... Whatever, it's fine, I guess. I say that, but I did lose a lot of eggs doing that. But also, there's eggs everywhere, so does it really matter all that much? Probably, honestly. So, this was like our first sort of run around this place. We found some things. Uh, there's still more to do, though. There's a lot more to do. Like, we're not even done with the ground level, I feel like. I think, maybe, I'm not sure. No, there's a place we can go. Alright, well, next time, we'll keep running around.